But if you close your eyes Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to this backflip drop-in tutorial. Um, backflip drop-in is where you're riding along the ramp and you do a backflip into the ramp. Um, I'll just give a quick demonstration so you know what it is. Okay, so basically, this is a very advanced trick. It took me a while to learn it. I would recommend doing it to Resi. Um, Preferably a really big resi quarter. If you live in Victoria, Brantfest has a really good resi quarter. That's where I learnt it. Um, and it really helped me. You had a lot of air time to be able to pull up the ramp. Um, it's self-explanatory. You're probably going to want to know how to backflip first. Um, but trying to backflip off a flat surface rather than a quarter or a bank is definitely a lot harder. So you're probably going to be able to... You're going to want to be able to do backflips off small things if not, um, banks. So, yeah. Um, another key thing is when you come up to the ramp, there's two ways of doing it. You can either do it straight into the quarter, or you can do it from a side angle and turn it. Um, I kind of do a mix of both. I go on a diagonal angle um, and turn at the last moment. Um, I can also do dead side and dead straight, but um, going diagonal is more fun for me. Um, now getting into how to do it, you approach the ramp with enough speed so that you're going to be able to clear off the edge because you really don't want to case your front wheel on the top of the ramp because that'll be bad. So um, approach it with enough speed to get over the edge. When you pull off the ramp, it's going to be very hard at first. It's like nothing you've ever felt before. Um, and then you can drop like a flare, you drop your shoulder so that way it'll turn you to be able to face down the face of the ramp. Um, so lift, pull, drop your shoulder, and then hopefully you'll be able to make the rotation. And if you do make the rotation, there's nothing left to do. You just roll away. Okay, so I'll do another demonstration. I will do a side, a straight, and my diagonal. So here's the side on. is my diagonal. And here is as straight as I can go with the amount of space I have. this tutorial I hope it helped um, if you're not as advanced and you're still watching this tutorial I hope you enjoyed it um, please click the subscribe button below follow my Instagram it'll be right here um, yeah thanks for watching